Welcome to Toy Poloi. Hello and welcome to another video from Toy Bloy and today it's going to be an unboxing video because a short while ago I was contacted by Andreas Vilksman from Germany and uh, he sent me a letter so let me just read that out to you it said hi Dave I'm a subscriber of your channel Toy Bloy and I'm enjoying your videos very much you inspired me to buy a few old broken toys and repair them to bring back childhood memories to me I'd like to say thank you very much for all the work and the effort that you put into this channel I've adopted so many tips and tricks to make my old toys shine again it would make me very happy if I could give something back to you and want to make a donation of an old toy. It's a Micronauts mobile exploration lab in the box from the 70s and so this is what has arrived today so I do need to say a massive thank you to Andreas uh, even before I open this but uh, let's open this package and see what is inside because as uh, I'm sure if you watch this channel you'll know that I do really like uh, Micronauts and Microman figures and have uh, quite a few of the figures dotted around my collection so uh, let's get this open and we'll see what's inside. go and there is another letter in here so let me just have a quick read of that it says hi Dave I hope the Micronauts mobile exploration lab has arrived in one piece it's missing the stickers and a very few parts like the arms and some other minor parts but I'm very confident that an experienced toy hunter like you will sooner or later find all the parts to complete it and let it shine again I know it will find a new good home at Toy Poloi around all the other toys thanks again for all the work and effort you put into the YouTube channel it's very inspiring to see somebody having so much joy repairing so many old toys and saving them from the trash can. People like you are the cornerstones of every hobby out there. Keep up the good work, take care of yourself and your family and stay healthy in these dark times. Kind regards from Germany, Andreas. Well that's a lovely note, thank you very much Andreas. Let's see if it did survive the journey across the, uh, the waters here to the UK. It looks like it did, it's nice and well packed. So uh, let's get this out. Wow, look at this, this is a beauty. Let me just get this out of the bag and we can see it in all its glory. So there we go, this is the Micronauts Mobile Exploration Lab. Let me move everything out of the way and we'll take a closer look at it. So here is the box and as we can see it's actually a German box which makes it even more interesting to me because obviously the ones I pick up here in the UK uh, have all the sort of British writing on it but this is uh, clearly in German at the top although it is still made by Airfix in the corner. Lovely box, I do like the artwork for these uh, sort of old Micronauts, very simple just nice pictures of the toy with the sort of standard logos on the front. Let's open this and see what's inside. Wowee! Look at all those bits and all those instructions. This is a joyous set to see. Look at it all. I think I might have to uh, quickly put this together so we can take a look at it in all its glory. Uh, all Micronauts uh, sets are great because you can sort of take them apart, combine them with other uh, pieces from uh, sort of your collection and make new things. Everything uses sort of standard size clips. So let's put this one together and uh, see if we can make it look a little bit like the box fronts, even though Andrea said there are a few bits missing, but I'm uh, sure we can make something out of it. It. So here you go, I've put together everything that was in that box and you can see that there we have the basis of the mobile exploration lab. There's uh, quite a few pieces missing as Andreas said but that shouldn't be a problem. I think uh, with time I'll be able to track those down and get this set fully operational again and it's going to be quite a fun job because uh, Microsoft stuff is really great to work with. It's um, really sort of nicely made toys, there's lots of detail in them and the fact that you can take these things apart and sort of reconfigure them to be other spaceships and other sort of combinations, they're just a fantastic toy to 
to work on. So now for me the job is to try and track down all of the missing parts for this playset. I do see them sort of crop up from time to time on eBay and I think that's where I'm going to head first just to see if I can get some of the major missing parts for it. But uh, yeah, massive thanks again to Andreas. He, he will be receiving some toy polloid badges and some other bits and pieces as a thank you from me. And I uh, hope this video has been of interest to you. If it has then hit the subscribe button and tap the bell to be notified each time I upload a new video. And thanks for watching. Thanks for watching Toy Ploy. Subscribe for more great videos. You can also follow Toy Ploy on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.